Hello Donuts, today we will be watching Love Island's Most Explosive Moments Part 2. I was coming back here to tell you that I loved you. And as this video goes on, the bigger the bust ups get, so let's get to it. You were saying to me, like, I wouldn't, I would never have done that to you, I would never have done that to you, but you literally did that to Molly, babe. Who is that? Who is that woman? Was she on this? I feel like I've watched every Love Island series and I've never seen that woman in my life. It's, it's, it's no, like, wait, no, wait, no, wait, 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 wait. If, if we, wait, can, wait, if we say no, practice no, what you play. No, no, calm down now. Um, don't tell <laughs> this moron was iconic. If there's one person that I would uh, like to, I don't know, have on a podcast, it would probably be her out of like reality TV shows. Not ever. Right? If I could choose anyone, I'd probably choose Nelson Mandela. Actually, would I? I don't know what I'd ask him. Like, I don't know what, what he's favorite sex position probably no i wouldn't that's weird cam i don't even is he still i'm gonna move on from nelson mandela i've not done anything i've not said anything. before i came in they were not together no they hadn't kissed yeah 100 so, is that molly me go on lass so i don't know what you mean by that but you're saying you're saying it's girl code and you're saying that basically i, I can't have options open he asked to get to know me i never oh, said i wanted to get to know him you have hurt someone else's feelings <laughs> for regarding a girls and not, not listening to girl code do you know what i mean <laughs> have you seen her going, uh, uh, Mm. You can't sit there and say it to me and make me feel I, like shit and then I think it, me up see, all night because is, I feel this like is shit. This is really, really annoying because before I came in here, they were not together. Was that really the first fight? That wasn't explosive at all. This is not what I came for. That was just a, just a, an exchange of words. I want fights. I want screaming. I want mental breakdowns. You haven't even pulled me aside for a chat just to be like, Mo, are you... Molly Mae looks like a highlighter there. Do you know what I mean? Like the ones in school that they'd give you. She looks like one of those. I want to have a boy in my life that literally worships the ground that I walk on. Are you having a laugh? I know, I know. The last six days you've been great. Like Tommy Fury went from getting shouted at by his lass on national television to then fighting a man that, um, <laughs> a man that used to scream at Emil Heskey. This is, this is fantastic. What a glow up. Do not think I feel threatened by a stunning girl that's coming in. There's a fucking ring though. The guy that I like is a boxer. Like, how yeah. do you think I feel? You've not come over for one second and said, babe, like, shall we go and have a chat before you fucking pull? Ah, uh, they're so real. Honestly, so real. That's why I love them. That's why. <laughs> that's why I love Molly and Tommy. They're so real. Maura for a chat. Pull Maura for a chat. You you just been sat on the Yeah, space I've been talking to her Maura. because you've been throwing a fit. I saw you walk down the fucking stairs and go, like, left your Because arms. you hadn't asked me if I was alright. Tommy Fury's handsome, like, and he, like, you gotta give him that, he's just, what, what, what did they feed him as a child? This man is younger than me. Look at him compared to me. Hannah, can you put a side-by-side -side comparison? What did they feed him? What did they feed? I need to know. For my children, not for me, I'm done. I'm done. It's too late for me, but my children can still be saved. Didn't know that that was you from a scratch of the neck. You... I do this to you all the fucking time. You don't? I do. I thought it was you because the first time we ever kissed, we actually banged teeth. And that's what I was going off. And that's why I was like... Do people say that? Is that like a saying or did they actually bang teeth? I feel like I'm out the loop. Is this a saying? Do people say that now? All right, love. <laughs> do you want to go in me uh, financed milk and bang teeth? You already told me a couple of days ago that you're not interested in getting to know anyone else. That am I right or... Mm, am I right or am I wrong? <laughs> no, did, you... did you hear that? Mm? Mm -mm -mm. Shut your mouth, silly boy. The next person that gets in an argument with me is gonna get it. Is gonna get it. As soon as they start speaking, I'll be like, mm. No, I'm not. I'm not trying to be rude. You're I'm saying rude. no. Okay. No, no. Danny, stop speaking. Really I'm sure this woman was like a bi. I'm gonna get this wrong, but like a biomedical scientist, like something really, really smart. This woman should be saving the world. Not getting in arguments with, 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 with fucking, I don't know, boohoo models. This is not what sh her destiny should be. Think of the world. Hannah, I am in such, I, I am in such a good mood today. I love Love Island. I would die for this show. Cut me open. I bleed ITV too. I don't know what that means, but, but, but I, but I feel it. Okay? I feel it. Give you an opportunity to squash anything there. Yeah. So just don't say anything further about the situation unless it's directly to those people that Completely were over agree. there. But if I've got something to say, I will say it to you first. Not just to me, just- Is this- is, it, is this bloke just constantly getting like- Is this bloke just constantly messing up? Like, why is everyone going for him? I can't remember this series. Is this guy just a- A, a knucklehead? Is that what this guy is? Is he- is he just constantly just going around hurting everyone? By the way, Amber. That was her name, right? She's from the same place as me. Oh! Love! You smashed this show! Well done. Not trying to create a problem. And you Not have my word. Not trying to cause a problem. If I've got a problem, I'll bring it to you, all of you. Your word? 
Your word doesn't really mean that much at this point, though, does it? <laughs> Your word, as if it means shit. Am I? Uh, you see how like calm and composed she was? That's how you handle an argument. She was just like, yeah, yeah, your, your word means nothing. Your word means shit. Just quickly, 76.1% of you donuts are not subscribed to the channel. Press subscribe now so you never miss a video. Quick! Am I cringy? Am I OTT? You're a That's how I feel when, when... That's how I think you think of me. Do you think I'm cringy? Say yes or no in the comments. If you say no, I'm gonna hide you from this channel. Wait, if you say I'm not cringe. No, no, if you say I am cringe. Christ, fuck, fuck. Do you honestly think that I want to speak to you? You're a coward. You've nothing to say for yourself because you know you're a barefaced fucking liar. I'm not barefaced liar. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. One thing that is going for this guy, tremendous jawline, Christ. Could get a paper cut on that. Jesus Christ, bless his barber. I'm an, I'm an attention seeker. Why did you get no. into bed with me last night and kiss me like that if you think I'm a fucking attention seeker? Why? Listen, can we just And I'm cringy. No, and I'm OTT. No. You're fucking joking. How I dare said, you I say those things about me? I said I initially thought them things. No, I you said those tonight. things. I asked you yesterday and you couldn't be honest. You said those things. You're calling me an attention seeker. You're fucking doing nothing, you stupid little toss part. Sorry, any Irish people watching, you've... I am definitely cringe now. You're a barefaced liar, you're a coward. And you know what else? You're playing a fucking game. You can fuck off. I know for a fact now the girls that wear you hate me. No, they don't. So let people be hurt instead of being like people give you dirty looks and kind why, of comments. Why are you raising your voice at this? Like, I'm absolutely honestly, not. This you is are. not. She, she didn't. She didn't raise her voice. Right, right. Uh, she she kind of kept the same tone. I was actually monitoring it on my tone checker. Same tone. Stop trying to gaslight her. You horrible, horrible man. I was coming back here to tell you that I loved you. <gasps> I was coming back here to tell you I loved you, right? And I come back. Why is this bad? I've got I've, I've not I've not been given the relative context to this. Oh, what? Why does he look sad? Telling if she's telling him that she loves him, but this is a bad thing. He must have messed up. Curtis Pritchard, what have you done? I can't remember. And I've been away for four days, and I come back to find out that you've been slugging other people, you've been telling other people you fancy them, telling who you recoupled with them. I asked her to recouple, she said no, and I said I was going to continue pursuing her. You asked her to recouple, and she said no. Why, why would you continue pursuing her like that? Just leave it. She doesn't want you. She doesn't want your ass. Move on. That door's closed. You've got a lovely lady in front of you. Why are you doing this to her? I was, and then I realised that it was the wrong thing to do. I said that before. So do you think I deserve better than that? Yes. Do you think I deserve to worry every single time you go off somewhere? No. I've made myself look like an utter... No, you've made me yes, look an utter, I have. utter mug. Not you, yeah. I've made you look like an absolute mug. Why is he talking like that? I get it, he's like admitted it. Okay, he's admitting that he's messed up, but why is he talking like this? It's like he's in court. Like, this man is just... just taking it. Just on... just, just, just... Oof, oof, oof. What do you look like? You look like a piece of shit. Why some... You ask a girl out two days later, you ask... Everyone was requesting this in the part one we did. Store Manor. Is this Store Manor? I haven't seen this part. I think I stopped watching this series like halfway through. You go to be your girlfriend and then two That's days later up. you're hitting on her. That's fucked up. I'm not hitting on her, I'm just trying you to You tried to tell me today that you like another girl. Two days! Two days! You grab another girl in front of my it's fucking face! What? Well, I'm, I'm not allowed to have a conversation. It's fucked up! Why have you got what no respect for her? What are you on about? It's disrespectful for who? Sorry, I've just got one thing to say. Who's Jordan again? <laughs> That's the most iconic line ever. And I don't even, it wasn't that on like Foot Asylum. I don't even think that was on this TV show. It wasn't. No, it wasn't. Be sitting over there like a goddamn mug. Yeah, you but you don't, like don't even know what I've said. You don't even know what I've said. That's not the point. You don't even know what I've said. You don't even know what I've said. That's not the point. What's the point then? I'm not allowed to have a conversation with someone. You're the most negative person I've ever met in my whole life. Why are you shouting about that? Turn it on. That's what you do. That's how you get them, you gaslight them. They pull you up when you do something wrong and you go, you're just negative. You, you're the issue. You are trying to hold me accountable. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's how I'm gonna stop this argument, just mm. A good old Yawande told me that one. Yeah, they always do this. They're like, you, you can't gaslight someone live in front of like the nation as well, because everyone's just gonna be like, oh, he's a bit of a bell end. Like fair enough to that Curtis guy, at least he owned up to it. At least he was like, yeah, yeah, it's me, I'm, I'm the issue. Yeah, like literally, I know I've messed up. This guy's just not having it. Stop! 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 St
still have the fucking She's balls. She's already come up to me and says that Curtis told her that you liked India, and then I come up to you and you're like, I'm going to tell you today. You've been avoiding she me for today. Small. You made me feel like a piece of shit. You're an embarrassment. Well, all I want to do is speak yeah, to I can, you. Yeah, I can understand that, and I think we can talk. Is this, this is, this is all from the same series, by the way. I haven't even moved on to the next series. I'm just continuing with this one. How much drama was in this one? Love Island 2019, did, if you watched this, was this one of the best series? Because I feel like I need to go back and rewatch it. I'm just angry at the fact that he asked her to be his girlfriend a few days ago, and now he's cracking on with someone else behind her back. Dickhead. No, he's, he's bloody brave he's for doing it. Wow. That's <laughs> cheating, Curtis. He could have... That's, that is when boys will just stick by you no matter what. Yeah, he's really brave for cheating on you. Can you just, I know it like it's messed up your entire life, but can you just write his bravery for not one second even thought about your feelings? And that, my friend, is what I call brave. Okay? That's like killing like loads of people. And then your friend's like, well, can you just rate uh, the audacity? Like, he went out of his way to kill these people. He tracked them down for months. You've got to at least rate the dedication. That's cheating. He could have led her on just the it's whole time. cheating. It's cheating. Yeah, but he's only just had these feelings now. And it, it doesn't matter. He could have just spoke to her. Are you inside his head? No. Well, Am I inside his head? No. Well, then why Are give you advice if you didn't know what no. you were doing in this situation? If you, I'm if, not inside her head, no. So in this situation, so if, given if, the wrong if advice, I was your girlfriend, then. you would do the same thing. I don't know what I would do with you, Maura. Well, well, the answer that I would want is that you <laughs> wouldn't do that. This guy is terrible. <laughs> this guy. Oh, my God. Imagine if you if you had, like, a, you know, you go to jail and you couldn't afford a lawyer, so you just get, like, the, the, the public defenders and this guy turned up. He'd be like, oh, I'd rather defend myself. That's the guy that said childish, isn't it? And he's like, it's childish. You're, you're childish. Childish. For four weeks, you basically made this girl out like she was fucking everything. You and like her so much. Made me Your head like wouldn't be dickhead. turned. I'd make nobody out like a dickhead. Just to set things straight here, yeah, I opened up to that guy, and now he's saying that I made him look open like a up. dickhead. You didn't open up. You yeah. need you to calm up. yourself you down, mate. Stop acting like the goddamn big man, cause you're not. Oh. Amber. Yes. Ah. You put that little muscly man in his place. And what I was going to say, if you'd let me the marriage thing, I was just going to say, there's a lot of traits i see in you that I could see as wife material. And that's what I was going to say to you. But you shut me down straight away. And that is honestly... That's a little intense, isn't it? Like, if you're, if you've, like, you know, only known someone for, like, a week or so, and then you're like, you know what? I think I could make you my wife. Do you want to belong to me? I feel like it's a little bit intense. Like, if someone said that to me, I'd be like, whoa, whoa, I, I literally, I even, even met your mom yet. I don't feel like I've done anything wrong. Maybe. You don't feel like you've done anything no, wrong? No, I don't. You Look at this, this woman's earrings. This woman has the power of Christ boiling in her. Her crosses are so big, they're making her cross. Surely, right, you know, if you, when you put one of those in, does your head not go like, Ugh, and then you have to put like the other one in to like balance you? Surely for like a split second, you're just walking around the place like this. I'll unravel myself, two sex. You've mugged me off, you've embarrassed me, yeah. you've made me feel like <laughs> shit, I've pretty much cried in front of you, and you've even gone, are you okay? You He's like, bro, stop it, stop it, he's already dead. If you found what you want, you better leave my big lady on. So like... What? What would you do in your, in your position? I don't know. Is this guy, this, this childish guy, did he just like... Like, mess with so many people. Lads in this season have just been, have just been smoked. They're all just getting shouted at, like Tommy Fury. Not even he was safe, even Molly was shouting at him. Guys, we need to do better. What are we doing? We need the girls to get shouted at. We need to fight back. I feel like the way that you blew off on one was just rash. And I feel like I'd, I'd rather just squash things, to be honest with you. You got anything in now? Mm. Did yeah, you think we were together then? No. <laughs> then why is it over then? So I'm just closing the book. Did the you way think that you handle it? situations. Why are you closing the book? I feel like the, the way that you open? handle the situations Did you think the book was open? Absolute... What? What? Are they... All of these, 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 uh, metaphors, spooks. Why are we bringing books into this? What's Roald Dahl got to do with this bust up? This is what confused me today. I feel like a, like a granddad, but like, don't you have, you have like, you're speaking, and then sometimes you have like, situationships, and then you're together, but you're not boyfriend and girlfriend, you're just seeing each other. Like, what? There's these labels, guys. Guys. What's going on? This guy's trying to close it and she's like, wait, was it even open? He's like, wait, was it open? Was there a book? I, I don't know. What what page of the book? Nobody knows. We need to bring it back to just being boyfriend or girlfriend or nothing. Can we start this as the donuts? Just, just, just put that into the world. Just, I don't know, just shout. Just shout in your back garden. Go in now. Pause the video. 
go and shout when you're back on and just be like, can we just, <laughs> can we just have things back to how they were? Hi. I'm the land piece, oh. Oh Come on, hey guys. <laughs> What's Dan doing? Can someone help me? What's going on, bro? My man, I just like you. Oh, just smile, smile. Don't be a dick, just smile. There was sort of a bit of a tension as soon as the, both of the girls walked into the villa. Katie was very much looking to see how Scott was going to react when he walked into the villa with Malia. I think she wanted to see how... Wait, with, with who? With Malia? This guy has went on a date and brought back an entire city from Greece. This guy has brought a party island back with him. He's not even looking at me. Yeah, fine. Ooh. How's it going? How's it going? I feel like they need to do, like... I think on this Love Island series, I'm pretty sure this was the second season. They used to just get let them get pissed. They need to do this. Like, I've just started watching Big Brother. By the way, let us know if you want us to react to Big Brother this year. And they, like, just on the opening night, just give them loads of Prosecco. And then, like, it was really interesting. Like, I know it's kind of... It is a little bit dark getting them all drunk, but I suppose if you sign up for that show, like, that's just, you know, what you, you... It's meant to be drama. We need to get the contestants drunk again. Why are we not getting them drunk? We need to get these influencers to show who they really are. All right, can I tell you, can I tell you what happened? So me and Dan get called for a beer, right? Next thing we both get a text, yeah? Oh, I've had... Oh, this guy's, like, t so, comf like, overly confident. You know when you go to, like, a house party or something, and he's like, huh, all right, guys, you know? Eh? Just, like, far too, like, enthusiastic about the whole thing. That is this guy. The guy that when he like tries to talk to you, like. Oh, no, 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 be back, no, be back. You annoy me. Like, the first, no, listen to me. The first day, I've let my guard down. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. 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 Give us a kiss. Shut you up. Especially when he like Let's pulls all sit you a down. Start. Yeah. Sit down. God, there's that. Didn't that's Sophie, right? She she uh, unfortunately passed away, didn't she? She was a legend. Bless her soul. And I deliberately sat down next to Scott's date because I didn't want her thinking that I was annoyed with her. That's so funny. You not even call that name. Just Scott's date. Contestant number 16. No, it was literally oh, just the Terry thing, that's it. it. You're on fucking shit! Oh, shit! Did you do that on purpose? No, that at least that's not on my hands. Oh my god. Drink. We reacted this to this in the first one. If you want to watch my reaction to that, go and watch the first episode after this one. Oh my god, she definitely did that on purpose. Can you imagine? Of course you're going to do that. If I was in Love Island and then this, like, this beautiful man came in trying to take my woman. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw Fanta on his leg. You know what, I'll, I'll get red wine and I'll put it on his bloody linen shorts. Ah! No, I'm nearly winded me. Well, you're getting into my stomach. Wait, no, I'm um, Luke again. Oh, shit, I didn't. Did you come to my house? <laughs> <laughs> to Joe? <laughs> what the hell is he doing? Jack. Why is he doing that? It's like, do you know in uh, Nemo, when the, 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 the lass with the braces start shaking Nemo? Just kept shaking him. I feel like this is what he's doing. She is Nemo in this situation. Love, run. Gemma, own, get out of here. This man is not good for you. I keep chasing all the lads and laughing at me and running after you anyway. You so... were not on the terrace, no. No. What? You were not on the terrace, no. Liar. <laughs> Liar. How does he get the twang at the end? Liar. Liar! We are uh, acting so. I understood you the first day that you walked in. Do you think that I'm stupid? Eh? For this is the reason why I was not opening myself. Because I'm scared to be hurt from the woman like you. Oh, how blessed Daffy. Bless him. He's opening up, but why is it so why is it so funny? Like he's he's been deadly serious yet and he's genuinely hurt, but I I'm just pissing myself. Right, I'm not gonna laugh because he's opening up. We are acting so. So, I hope you find your love of your life with me, you close. <laughs> you Telling you that you are a liar. You don't yes. care about me. You you are a liar. Yes. Him, now so. I don't give a shit about you, don't oh, worry. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't give a shit you about you. You never did give a shit about me. And no, then... now I actually don't give a shit about you. You are a liar, actress. Oh that line. You are a liar, an actress. Get the fuck out. Go on. Go on, inject it. Go on. Inject it in their veins. Anyway, guys, I'm going to stop this right here. If you would like to watch part one of Love Island's most explosive moments, click right here. Or if you want to watch me react to an even cringier show, click right here.